Yes. Anyway, good evening. Good I'm evening. Sir Dan Smith. This is the lovely Miss Carol Ginger Gray. Welcome oh, hi, to the Scarborough Cultural well. Center of 35th Annual Celebration here. Yeah. We want to congratulate you and all the other guests, but tell us your name and your particular presence mm -hmm. being here and being an honorary okay. or a presenter okay. in this special award moment okay. here. Well, uh, my name is James Pickens, and I'm here as one of the co-MCs tonight along with uh, Amy Garcia. Uh, and actually, this is my second year. I, my, I, I emceed last year, and I guess they thought I did a good job, so they asked me back. <laughs> I didn't mess great. up too many post Absolutely names. Absolutely yeah. great job. <laughs> great. Thank you. All yes. Right. You want to tell us your experience in seeing the development of these particular event every year? Uh, well, I just put well, directors was, and writers. I, was, I had heard of this event. I had heard of the, the, the organization, but it was my last year was my first time actually being involved. But it's obviously it's the 35th year. Uh, it was started uh, to celebrate producers and writers and directors and those folks who aren't always in front of the camera, but without their what they bring to the the industry in terms of their talent and vision, we, we wouldn't have any. So they wanted to celebrate and honor those uh, those uh, individuals this evening and for the last 35 years. And I, I think it's much needed. And uh, the folks who um, thought this was a good idea, I think, were visionaries in their own right. Yes. Well, in, in the diversity of the ideas and the writers and the directors, uh, how do you feel that it's made the film industry better in recognizing mm -hmm. the people behind the scenes that create the stories oh, yeah. that um, are expo exported to the public? Oh, absolutely. I think it's, it's, it's very important. Obviously, directors, producers, I mean, you, you don't see them. They, 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 they kind of go, they do their job, they ply their trade, uh, and you, you see the finished product when you watch a film or you, when you watch a television show that you like. Um, but uh, they are, their talents uh, are, are so important to this industry uh, on, on how you multitask and, and how you are able to navigate and, and make this business kind of which can be very crazy and herky-jerky. And, <laughs> and, and folks are able to put a handle on it and, and fashion it and shape it in such a way that when you look at a TV show or a film, you really don't know what is going into that. Yeah. Wow. Well, this is amazing. Well, Miss Gray, she would like to just ask you just a brief question. We're going to just briefly let you go there just a moment. Yes. I was just thinking, you know, Sir Dan and I, we are Advent uh, TV watchers of black and white movies. We love black and white black movies. And white, oh, yes, we do. We love them. They are are so full of uh, it, it, now today children I mean the kids that watch TV today would not think so but we mm -hmm. it is dramatic mm -hmm. uh, it is uh, unique mm -hmm. and we enjoy watching the black and my, uh, white movies because we think that they have more uh, mm -hmm. more content yeah. they look better <laughs> yeah. I always thought black and white look better yes, yeah. they do. Mm -hmm. and so uh, you're a producer director uh, I'm a producer but I'm, I'm, I'm on a, a show right now I'm on Grace Anatomy, and we just celebrated our 300th episode in our 14th season, so uh, I'm pretty excited about that. And what was your name again? James Pickens. James Pickens. Mm -hmm. Okay, thank you so much, James. You're more than welcome. Mr. Pickens, mm -hmm. would, would you mind if we got a picture with you?